my door list and my window list when you come back to this navigation project here you will see a door list here and a window list once you open it it shows you the list of doors you have in your design the, the name of door the quantity of the door the number of doors and everything to show you their quantity so how can you copy this you just go to edit how can you bring this to your design for printing you come to edit and click on copy that's copied what is here come back to ground floor and paste it onto ground floor and then paste it ctrl v paste it you can see so i can now move this over to my design here so do the same thing for window list too once i open my window schedules i come over to edit click on copy after copy i come back to ground floor and ctrl v i paste it right here And okay then after i'm done with this i also come and let me also work on let me also do a little working on it let me arrange this so at the door list is showing me all the doors that i've used and if you watch these two are actually the same 750 by 21 and 750 by 21 but why is bringing it in in two places is because of the direction of the door one is swinging to the right while the other is swinging to the left one is swinging to the left while this one is swinging to the right so i'll just choose one i'll just have to choose one at the floor plan then i'll just have to choose just one so i would make i'll make this one to be then four i'll bring out i have this one two then this one two in quantity so i'll just make this to be okay before i actually can edit anything i have to ungroup it so I have to ungroup the entire day. So Control Shift G, I've ungrouped it. So now I can now edit in the flop. I can now edit the door and the window list now. So I'll change this to four. Change this to four, which is adding this other two. Why delete this? I'm assuming that at the flop plan, I will know the direction of slope or direction of swinging same thing applies to one two by two one so i can join this to this okay this one we have because it does not apply here actually here we have one two by two one and one two by two one but the difference is that this one is swinging this is a sliding door so it does not apply here so i just join my doors together So after joining, I can now edit this. All right. So I'm done with my door schedule. So I'll come back to window schedules. So all these empty, all these particular openings here are my arches. Those empty window openings I use in my design. So this is what that fact is bringing me everything window I inserted in my design. So why all these ones here are the empty window openings of different sizes I used in my design. So since I'm doing just window list, I will just have to delete all this. So I'll delete all this. So I'll come back to windows I use. So I have windows of one to one six hundred by six hundred repeating itself. This one is three, this one is one. I'll make this one to be four. Why delete the other one? I'm adding the other one to it. I'll make this to be four. Why delete this? Same thing applies to one thousand by one five. We have one here and eight here, so I'll make this to be nine. Why did it the other one? So the quantity now is nine. I'm going to delete this. Okay, this is 750 by one. It's all these windows here are different, so I'll join this together. If you watch in my door list, also, you can watch that. The smaller window started first, then continues to the bigger one. 
the smaller window started first. We have 750 by 21, 900, 12. It was not scattered. Same thing should also apply in my window schedules also to make it more uniformly. So we have a window of 600. The next that should come in line should be the smallest. The next smaller than this. So that will make me to adjust my window to rearrange it to make sure that the smaller one comes first. Though I'm not saying it's the most, but to make sure work looks nice while you're presenting it just necessary to add some ideas to your work so this is one of the things i do so we have 600 for 600 by 600 it is 450 by 15 750 by 18 1000 by 15 1000 by then 12 by 15 just to make it looks uniform like as if it's progressing so i'll do this here and i can trim off this other part too. I can just trim this off since it's very long. Come over to split. Then I split this off. Delete the other part while I join these together. Alright, done. So I'm done with my doors and window schedules. I can just bring them closely and separate it a bit. So I can then get one of these and also right here doors and windows schedule 